Gav, a narrow 1 0 defeat to Connors Key this afternoon. And um, what were your thoughts on the game? Felt for the ball, felt for the players' feet. <laughs> um, look, it was an honest, combative game between, you know, two sets of men that uh, that went to the fight for their clubs. Um, we've come out shy on that in terms of the uh, the result in the end, but I thought we were more than competitive um, for long periods. And in the second half, I think we were the better team. As expected, it was quite an aerial game. Um, how do you think your team dealt with the balls into the box? Um, relatively well. Um, look, you know you're going to have to come... They, they do it very well, you know. Um, but today, that was the only style of football that both teams could play, you know. I don't want to say too much about the pitch because you know we're lucky that we we don't have to deal with that a lot. But I haven't seen a pitch like that for many many years, like playing on the moon, um, and and that's not right for them because it's not good enough for them. And I know it's not good enough for the league. But you know, both teams had to try and muster a way to find a way. Um, and unfortunately, with some key decisions at the end, or maybe a lack of taking our opportunities at the end, maybe we should be going down the road with uh, with a point. Um, sadly, we don't. But following Tuesday. Uh, the performance on Tuesday. Um, I'm just pleased to see the level of reaction we got from the boys today. I thought they were, they were fantastic. Yeah, we, we didn't get that result that we deserved, but how important was that performance in response to Tuesday night? Oh, listen, you know, teams want to fight with the boys, they'll fight. You know, uh, teams want to play football, they'll play football. And um, today was probably a little bit of a combination of both, you know. Um, but yeah, I, th I just really wanted to see the whites of their eyes today. And um, I have to say, I thought they were fantastic. And Tuesday was passive. You know, I've got to accept some responsibility there as well, you know. Um, you know, up against a full-time team on a Tuesday night, maybe I should have freshened up a little bit more. You know, I'm as you know as culpable, if not more culpable, than anyone in the club for results. So that was disappointing. But today, really, really proud of my lads. Um, I don't want to be a proud loser. Um, you know, happy to happy to lose one nil and everyone taps you on the head. I'm just really delighted today that um, whilst in the first half, Connors Key were the better team, and Mike saves a penalty to stop it going two nil. I think I'm really proud, particularly the second half performance where we were front foot orientated. You know, create a couple of good opportunities that we should score more from um, and arguably should have gone down the road with a point. I was going to say, I mean, one of them at half-time, that second-half performance, you know, number of chances. Did we deserve more from the game? I think so. Um, look, it's hard to say that. You know, they hit the post really late on on a counter-attack and I'm talking in the dying stages. Um, but what I will say is the game is defined by very, very small margins. I've got to give Mike Wall credit. I don't think there's another striker in the league that scores that type of header you know, in, anymore. Um, and, you know, it's a fantastic goal from his perspective and their perspective, disappointing from mine and ours. Um, but that's to find the game. And, you know, that's the reason why they're the champions and, and we're not. Looking ahead to Tuesday, um, Penn and Bottom at home, as it is in phase two, um, another very, very tough game. Yeah, they're all tough, you know. Um, but we look forward to it. We look forward to every challenge. It's a chance to weigh yourself. It's a chance to uh, to challenge yourself. And uh, we'll see how the boys heal now. And we look forward to uh, to what's obviously going to be a tough game. They're, they're having a really good season. Um, but the hope is now that, uh, you know, we show that intensity and that fight and that desire. And then add a little bit more quality of game to be, be a good team ourselves. Thanks, Gary. Cheers, Paul.